Hi, it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak. Today we're going to do C1 anterior translation. So the key is when you want to get somebody's neck into a posterior glide, I can either push the occiput backwards or I can put C1 forward. We're going to choose on this one to do C1 forward. Key is start from the top of the table. We're going to come in, I like to find C2. And then what I'll do is I'll, I'll work my way more step towards the top of the head. And I'll go out about about two inches out to the side, and you're going to be right in the joint. So if you can see it, the joint is there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hand, other hand, and my dummy thumb is my right, other finger. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to push down. I'm going to push down towards his eye. So I'm going to kind of over a little bit. I'm going to push down towards his eye, take up the slack, and spring it. So my motion is that towards his eye. Now if I do the same thing on the other side, I found C2, come up to C1, come out a couple inches out, where the joint would be, dummy thumb is here, active thumb is here, come over a little bit, pushing down towards his eye, and we get that translation. So it's again, it's that type of motion. All right, so it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak.